In this short video, I'm going to explain how you can use the redirect function in Easy Mobile Site Generator to redirect from one mobile site to another another mobile site or just to another general site. It doesn't have to be a mobile site, but obviously it's better if you redirect people from your mobile site to other mobile friendly sites as they will already be on a mobile phone and there's no point to redirect them to sites that aren't mobile friendly. So on here I've got, um, let me just go to this page first of all, here I've got um, a page and down here I've got a link to another menu choice. Now I've actually got that one set up to link somewhere else but just so that I can show you the concept really. Okay so let's go here. What I've actually done here this is the text that would appear on a page and if I go down to the bottom here that's the sort of text I would expect to see there. But what I've actually done is here I've actually put in the redirect settings redirect to URL and I've entered Google search query equals beer. So now what would happen is if someone clicked on that icon on the menu choice on that other page instead of coming and seeing this page here they would actually get redirected to a Google search with a query of beer. Now it could be that I wanted to send them to another website. Maybe for example I wanted to send them to um, easybeersales.com. That doesn't actually exist but it's just something I made up uh, here. So let's just put that in for now just so you can see the, the concept of what I'm talking about. Um, so easy beers, no, let's call it um, easy 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 bar dot com. Let's call it that one. So let's just uh, quickly update that. You'll see why I'm doing that in just one second. Maybe, for example, uh, we were doing a a setup for a company that had several different businesses. So instead of let me just go back and change the, the text here. Um, let's call that one Easy Bar. So clicking on that would redirect to easybar.com. Maybe this company has several different uh, businesses. Let's just add a new page here. And call this one easy auto sales. Um, so let's just put easy auto sales there. Let's find a picture of a car, maybe. Yeah, car. Uh, for that. And let's redirect that. to http easy auto com okay let's go back to our site ah, I forgot to add that Um forgot to make make it linked in to that, so let's just find it. There we go there. Forgot to put the parent on to link it in. So it's part of this one here. It's coming in there. It's near that number two. Update. Go back to current site. Yep, yeah, and it should be there now, that's right. So let's do another one. Um, let's just make this one called Easy Shopping. Notice I'm not putting any text in here, I don't really need any text in for this. All I'm really doing is using these as placeholders. So Easy Shopping, let's find a, a shopping icon, shopping cart. Okay, that will do. 
and let's redirect that one to easyshopping.com. Again, this is something that doesn't exist, but I'm just putting it here just to give you an explanation and show you how you could use this sort of thing. Again, I forgot to put the parent in there to link it into my menu. Trying to do this too quickly. So I want that to go with that one. And make that go three. Dead. And go to current site. And now we've got easy bar, easy auto sales, easy shopping on this page. So I go to this page and let's look at the, the preview screen down there. So now I've got these three icons here. If I click that one, it would take us to easybar.com. That one would take us to easyautosales.com. And that one would take us to easyshopping.com. So you can redirect people off your mobile site pages to other sites just purely by putting in a URL in that redirection entry in the, the options. So it's that there. Just put a URL in there and it will redirect. Instead of to a particular page on your site, it will redirect to whatever URL you place there. Now you can actually also use that to redirect to other pages on your site if you wanted to, but really it's meant to redirect off your site.